Hello everyone, my name is Joey here for DFB, and today we're going to be taking a look at one of our favorite restaurants, Les Halles Belangerie Pétisserie. This French-themed restaurant is tucked away towards the back end of the France Pavilion in Epcot, and it's made to resemble a quaint French bakery. It used to be located next door to what is currently Les Artisans de Glacé, but when Les Halles outgrew the crowded shop, it was moved to its current location. Seating at Les Halles is available both indoors and outdoors. The indoor seating area is in the same area as a merchandise shop, so it tends to be crowded during the day. Our absolute favorite time to go is in the morning, because unlike most of the World Showcase, Les Halles is open at 9 a.m., making this a great breakfast option that offers some unique items along with some really great scenery. So, on to the food. First up is the roulet lard and fromage, or the bacon and cheese roll. This treat is $3.95 and is snack credit eligible. This is one of the more savory items offered at Leal, with a pinwheel of bread and cheese baked into the roll sprinkled with chopped bacon pieces. There is a ton of bacon on this thing. It's sprinkled on top, but it's also placed in between the layers of bread as well. We thought it tasted amazing. The texture has the perfect crunchiness from the baked on cheese, and the sweetness of the roll combos great with the saltiness of the bacon. For the price, we thought this was a great deal between the size of the pastry and the amount of bacon. It's sold all day long, so if you don't make it for breakfast, it can still be enjoyed at any time of the day. Next up, let's take a look at the Duo. This one is $5.75 and is also snack credit eligible. It's a dome of chocolate with a white chocolate shaving as a topper and shaved white almonds on the bottom. Once you cut it open, however, you can really see where it gets its name, with the combination of white and dark chocolate mousse on top of a thin layer of chocolate cake. The mousse is the perfect amount of lightness because this is an incredibly rich treat. The white and dark flavor combination is amazing, and the layer of cake beneath it gives it that extra bit of texture. We'd say that this is a must-buy for any chocolate lover out there, and we really loved how pretty the pastry is, making it seem like even more of an indulgence. Now, let's move on to the macaron. This treat is also $5.75 and is snack credit eligible as well. The flavor we're looking at is the raspberry lime, and while they will always have a larger specialty macaron available for individual purchase, there is also a boxed macarons collection available for $10.33. Like the duo, we found this to be a very pretty pastry with its pinkish color and fresh whole raspberries. The two shells have that classic meringue-like texture and are raspberry flavored. Inside the macaron are two layers of raspberry jam, whole raspberries, and dollops of lime meringue, we really loved the texture since they're made fresh in-house, the perfectly crispy outside with a very soft and delicate center. We'd also consider this a must-have for any visit to Leal. With the jam and the raspberries, it is definitely on the tart side, and you also get some prominent almond flavor from the shells. And finally, we wanted to take a quick look at the cappuccino. This is $3.99 and is also snack credit eligible. There's nothing too out of the ordinary with this, but we love that they offer a nice selection of hot beverages, including espresso, lattes, and hot chocolate. For being a quick service espresso drink, this tasted great, and it had a nice amount of foam that should be expected from a cappuccino. This is another great reason to stop by here for a morning cup of coffee, especially before it gets too warm outside. They also don't only serve coffee drinks, but they have alcoholic drinks as well, including mimosas. Overall, we definitely found Leal to be a must-go-to for any visit to Epcot, especially if you have the time to go first thing in the morning before the crowds start to get out of hand. The food here was just as beautiful as it is delicious, and the large display of items makes it easy to pick out your favorites. We definitely suggest taking the time to pick up a sweet or savory item here and to enjoy the beautiful French pavilion. One of our personal favorites is the frangipan, so be sure to sample that one as well. Well, that's it for this one. What are your favorite items from Leal? Let us know in the comments because we definitely want to know. For DFB, my name is Joey, and we'll see you in the next video.